Hello and welcome to the Cabbage Head and today I'm playing Kerbal Space Program. I'm here in my lovely little space center imajig and I'm going to build a rocket because that's what you've got to do. Um, I'm not particularly good at this game but oh well. Look, go away Werner von Kiermin. Get out. Right. Um, I'm going to try and build a space station uh, and it's probably going to end horribly and people are going to die, but oh well. Um, so to start off with, we don't want any Kerbals in this one because they will die probably. Um, so we'll get one of these, Drone Core, because that allows me, what should I get one of these? Does this have a reaction wheel in it? Um, no. Okay, I'm gonna put that back. Well, it made it made you, but I'm gonna take this one anyway. Um, this controls itself, which is good. So below that, I'm gonna want some fuel. Um, but right, this is gonna be top stage. I should no. Wait, I'll do that in a minute. But I want to put on the top this. Ta da! Um, yeah. This means I can dock loads of um, things if I put loads of docking ports on it, which I'm just about to do. Where are these docking ports? It's a really attachment point. Uh, where's the docker truck docking ports? Utility? There we go. Pop that up there. Why aren't you going on? Oh, that's not going around. Because you're the other one going around. There we go. Put that on there. Ugh. There we go. Put that one on there. And finally, this one on here. There we go. Bish bash bosh. Bob's your uncle and all that. Um, so this is what we will connect everything on to once it's in space, if it ever gets there. <laughs> so now we're going to get some fuel, and this will probably stay up with there, with this. Oh no, we don't want fuel first. What am I doing? We want one of these. If it actually connects. Okay, we go up. go in. Basically that stops all this from exploding from heat and other nasty things that happens when you go out of the atmosphere. Uh, sorry for my cold. I have a cold again. Sucks. Anyway. So we've got something to control it. Um, I'll probably stick some RCS below this. There we go. Long a bit of RCS there. And then one of these. Actually, I'm going to change the order of that. Right, now I have to redo the fairing. There we go. That looks very cool. And then I connect that to there. Right, or should I get a bigger one? I'm going to get a bigger one. There we go. Bigger is better. Most of the time. <laughs> and then, um... Poodle? Let's stick a poodle on the bottom. What? No, not the terrier. Look at that. <gasps> because it's so small. <laughs> um... And what type of fuel tank is this? Because it's different, like, makes and brands. It's a Kerbidoid. So I should probably use a Kerbidoid engine. Whiplash. <laughs> okay, probably won't use that one. Right, oh, forget it. Let's just use 
this one. This is the space. So it's fine. And now, command and control. RCS. Basically what the RCS does is it allows you to position oneself. And without it you will fly all over the place. <laughs> um, I'm going to change these the other way around. Um, okay. Now we're going to want a stack separator. What do we, is that the big one? Yeah, it is. I've had po problems with these in the past. So, oh well. It'll be fine. Don't worry. Um, now, for the mid stage, we are going to want one of these bad boys just lift all this up a bit um, yeah I'm gonna want one of these and what engine are we gonna want? something a bit meatier there we go, skipper right so skipper, separation blah blah okay good basically what this bit does here so scroll up, there we go, this bit it just takes all this off, but in space that doesn't matter. We'll be able to see it, and it'll be able to dock, and all those other lovely things. Um, what am I looking for? Structural, I believe. Is there not a bigger one? There is a big one. Oh, that looks bad. I'll use this one. There we go. Looks less bad now. And now for the lower stage. This is where we go a little bit overboard. So basically we stick loads of these together and then on the bottom of it we put this. Haha, -ha, look at it. Ouch. And we also put um, these. <laughs> Actually I'm going to allow them to radially separate. Basically fall off. Aerodynamicness. Um, Probably should go to aerodynamics for that. Um, is it these? No, they're too big. Um, this one? There we go. Okay, so it's these. Then, no. No. Uh, no. It's these and these. And then separation. And then separation up here. That's gonna break. I know that is. Yeah, look at it. So flimsy. Ugh. There we go. That should hold together a bit more. Possibly. <laughs> I'll put some aerodynamic bins on it because um, nothing is really known about this thing. Use it at your own risk. Um, I'm alright. Got five. Okay, it just help with control a little bit. Um, okay, what shall we call this thing? I'm going to call it space station. Nope. Oh, well, type <laughs> central. There we go. Um, save and launch. Right. We have to get it up and along into a stable orbit. That's the plan, anyway. R and T. That brings up RCS and SAS. Which all stability and stuff. Boom! We have lift off. Oh, that's quite loud. Uh, um, okay. We are lifting off slowly, but surely. Um, Is it leaning? No, it isn't. Good. Stop moving. Right, compared to the planet, I think I want it to go like along the coast, so go that way. Oh, they start to speed up now. Good go. Oh, not too much though. Don't go too much. 
Oh, bloody. Uh, right, there we go, keep it there. Keep it there. Come on. Right, these solid boosters are going to run out in a minute. And then I can move them. Don't blow up my engine. Thank you. Uh, so I can keep going with this. Up high into the atmosphere. There isn't much on Kerbin. In fact, there is nothing on Kerbin but my space agency. But oh well. Right, what's the map doing? What is the map doing? <laughs> right, okay. We're going to want to get into an orbit now. Okay, we're going in an orbit that way. Interesting. That's that's fine. Um, there's a polar orbit. Uh, but that's that's cool. And that's how you do a separation with explosions. Oh, this thing looks cool. Look at it. Right, and then the space music has kicked in. Now I need to point us in a more orbitly direction and boost. Okay, how much fuel? How much is the fuel going down? Um, okay, not not much. Right, we want to extend this bit round here so it goes all the way around and joins back up there. But we don't want to go too high. Da, da, da. Yes! There we go. Right, now this needs to be a bit higher. This is the lowest point. 60,000. And... Cut the engines. Okay. Right. Excellent. We are in orbit. Now I just need to go around the whole orbit to check that it's okay. Check that we don't end up back in the atmosphere again. So here we go, go around up the ISS. We go over the unloaded bit of land, down the other side. Uh, I'm saying down the other side, I mean. Don't really go down. But anyway. Look at that. Down past the poles and back up again almost to where we started. There we go. Which means I'm just gonna have to jettison all this fuel here. Um I don't particularly want to do. Especially the fact that it'll just float around with me. Um I'll let in that case let us point and I got the ah uh, I forgot to put uh, solar panels on the thing, and uh, uh, and now it's run out of electric charge. But now I can't do anything. Poo. Well, let's revert that back to assembly. Forty-eight minutes ago. Good damn it! Right, <laughs> but that's what happens. Okay, right. We will add. Some basic solar panels on the outside of here. And then inside here, we will add, if we can find them, some of these. They're kind of in the way. Let's just do four of them and then put them there. I'm going to put them there and hope they don't fall off. <sighs> Save and launch. Okay. Second time's lucky. Uh, that took so long to 
could get nowhere. But at least we know this ship can do it. Ship. Okay. Fire. And the loudness is yet again back. Okay, let's go this way. Pointing away from us so that we get in the middle of it straight away. Are we going to go around that way? I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do. I like heading in this direction. So. Solid fuels coming to the end of its life. So we'll wait for that to happen. We'll stuck to ship. And quiet. No blood open. Oh, ow. I'm okay. Oh, there's a bit of fire. We're going a bit quick. No, don't blow up my solar panels. Oh, it's okay. We're getting out of the atmosphere now. Okay, we're going the same way again. Now we need to avoid the problem we had earlier by doing this. That way we won't go so high. Let's have around 30 degrees. There we go. I don't actually know anything about where the numbers should be. I just kind of... Okay, now... Now we don't want to go up anymore. And ooh, that's a, that's a hot view. And boom! Aha! I love that. Um, look, why are you going down there? Did I ask you to point down there? And blast! Flying in the sky. Good song. Oh, look, look at all that debris. 68 kilometers away. That's all the, uh, I think that's all jet boosters. Yeah, that would be all jet boosters. The solid fuel boosters, do, 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 do. Space. Takes a long time. Oop, have these bits stuck together yet? Nope. Of course they haven't. However, they are coming over the poles. And once they get over the poles, it's very quick. We want to go down a little bit. I think we can extend these as well. These kind of gear. Oh, they don't. Extend. Extend. We'll see what these are. They are huge solar panels. They point towards the sun. Look at that. So majestic. Oh, they're coming around. Come on. Come on. Make a periapsis. There we go. Right, we want the periapsis to be... 70, 80... There we go. How high is that? 150. There we go. That's a lot more circular. Perfect. And we won't run out of electric charge. Brilliant. Right, we'll just do the old check. Oh, that's a bit quick. There we go. Over the. Oh no, that's not unloaded. That's just the ice caps at the top. The Kerbin Arctic. Then we go down over the back and we lose a lot of electric charge. Oh, dearie me. Okay, now we have no electric charge. And now we just drift in use. But now we have loads of electric charge again. <laughs> Okay, there's a small period at the back of the planet where we lose all our electricity. But that's okay. Kind of. Right, okay. Excellent. Uh, excellent, stop! Okay. 
flying. And that's about all I have time for. So I'm going to leave it here. Next time I'll dock something on here. But I need to learn how to do that. And we are. Are we still on thing? Okay, we're going quite fast. But that's all I've got time for. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all next time.